Hi, Dr. Karen Can here, and welcome to another Light Warrior Wisdom video. In this video series, I'll be highlighting some myths or common misconceptions or mistakes that Light Warrior sensitive souls make, preventing them from actually enjoying their life while they do their soul's mission. So today's video is going to be about honing your superpowers. Yes, your sensitivity superpowers. Now, the big mistake, that huge mistake, I guess, uh, that light warriors make is that even if they've gotten to the point where they go, okay, I'm a sensitive, I honor that I'm a sensitive, I'm not gonna be like anyone else, I'm not gonna try to be anyone else, I'm not gonna try to be normal, they miss the next step, which is now that I know that this is supposedly my gift, how do I hone it? Like, how do I train it? So, you know, you can take some of the most uh, talented uh, athletes in the world. Just because they're talented doesn't necessarily mean they're gonna make it at the Olympics because there's a lot that goes on in these elite athletes' lives to get them to that pinnacle. It's not just raw talent. Hard work, yes, absolutely. Dedication, absolutely. And an attitude that is empowering, absolutely. So I can't tell you there have been a lot of different, you know, very, very talented people I've seen uh, in person and also in the figure skating world, I'm a figure skater, uh, that we've seen over the years that did not make it to the high echelons of their athletic sport, not because they weren't the most talented person on earth, they probably were in that sport, but because they didn't have the other elements, you know? They trained their physical bodies, but they didn't train their minds or, you know, train their energetic bodies. So light warriors make the mistake of assuming now it's a gift. Okay, well, all right, it's a gift. You know, that's about it. Like, they don't go to the next step and go, okay, if this is a gift, then how, what, how, do, I, how do I work it? You know, how, how do I train it? So you have these gifts. Train them, you know, and if you don't know how to train them, uh, then, you know, search for somebody who does. Now, um, my work may or may not resonate with you, but I love helping these light warrior sensitive souls hone their superpowers. And we start really, really basic. But there's a, so much you can do. I, I guess maybe I shouldn't say basic since we train you to change the weather. But it, it actually is pretty basic, okay? But there's a lot of different things uh, that you can learn and they're not hard, but no one ever taught you. And just because you weren't taught in school, your parents didn't teach you, you know, uh, you didn't learn it elsewhere, the girl guides didn't teach you, whatever, doesn't mean you can't learn it now. It's never too late. So go out there and hone your superpowers. Know how to use them. Know how to use them in, in receiving information, discerning, interpreting that information. Learn how to use them in projecting healing energy throughout. You can do this. I believe in you. All right, guys. Lots of love. Have a wonderful day. Bye for now.